Right then, I'm in my camper van. I've arrived at my site. Set up camp. I'm in the nice, at the moment, quiet position. But apparently two more camper vans are coming, which could be in front of me. But no one's can park behind me or to the side of me because of um, something to do with the the grass getting, um, needs time to recover. Now just behind that hedge is a lane which I'm going to follow in a minute. That's going to take me down towards the coast. Now it's quite warm with the sun out. I don't really want to carry a big heavy coat but I don't know how far I'm going. Um, so I'm just taking my windshield and hoping for the best. Let's just go outside for a minute. So here I am. This is um, the campsite. There's Alberta. Um, that's some sort of hills over there. I haven't got my bearings yet. All I know is the the sea will be down that way over there. And I'm in a field. I'm just trying to see if I'll need a coat. Yeah, down over that way will be the, the sea. So I'm going to take a coat. I think I might take the coat. There's some hills over there in the background. There's Alberta and I've got that corner spot. I'll be climbing up that tomorrow, that over there. So this is Sheena, Porlock, near Minehead, doing a bit of coastal exploring. Um, I'm gonna, I'm just wreck, a little recce today. I've got here in plenty of time, I was here by just after 11, took about two hours, that's with stops and everything as well. I've uh, plugged I've plugged the electric in. Um, so it is, it is a really nice location I'm in at the moment. So I've got no idea where I'm going. It's difficult to know whether to take a coat because um, at the moment, it's really hot in the sun. I've got a windshield, of course. I don't know what to do. I don't want to get too hot either. Um, right. Over and out. <laughs> 